guys, this is Lammer Town's Ghost, and welcome back to another episode of Undertale, where we'll head back to where before we went to grow these Sands. Oh, hey, Papyrus is over here. Hi, Papyrus. So we came back to see him, I guess I did. <laughs> where are we going? Alright then. I'm not- there are multiple things I want to question here. You're one of them. I'm going to take your time. This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. <laughs> it's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Can you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. <laughs> oh, okay. That's the bathroom. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Something's gonna happen. Wait. I want to see what happens. I will, I will get this. I don't know what- <laughs> I'm trying to confuse- I'm trying to confuse Papyrus. <laughs> I'm spending like- Wait, come on. I will confuse Papyrus. Alright, whatever. I give up. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Sure, let's look at the jokes. That joke book was a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book was another joke book. You look inside! There's another quantum physics book! You decide to stop. That- that is- that's interesting. That's my room. If you finished looking around, we could go in and hang out like a pair of very cool friends. Go inside. We'll go inside in one second. This is a bone. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. The door is locked. I'm guessing that's Sans's room. I'm not going to question the energy. That's my room. <sighs> yes, we can go inside. Yes. Your room is amazing. That's my pet. Wind in your non-hair, sun on your non-skin. That's nice. Yes, action figures. <laughs> All right then. Here. There are no skeletons inside my closet except me sometimes. Sure. Alright then, this is interesting. <laughs> Begin the hangouts? Yes. Let's hang out. What are we doing? Hangout start? I've actually never done this before, but don't worry. Prepare for several letters from my name. Alright then. C key for friendship, A to D. What the heck? What is going on? Egg. Step two. Ask them to hang out. Ahem. Human. I, the great papyrus, will hang out with you. Yes. <laughs> I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Take a second. Wear clothing. That bandana around your head. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that. Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. Yes. 
Yes, yes. I'm just gonna be incredibly nice to Papyrus. What the heck is with your eyes? You flandered out. You're way better hanging out than I am. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What is going on? Can I wear clothing? Going on. <laughs> I'm just gonna be super nice. I like it. No? That's... Okay, no, it has to be mean to you. I'm sorry. I'm too nice. Just hard work and perseverance. The shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expert tip, all clothing articles can be improved this way. My hat? My hat. My hat! <laughs> what? Oh wait, I didn't even see what I clicked. I have no idea. I don't know what I clicked. I guess I clicked accept it. It is spaghetti! It isn't plain, plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti finally ate in an open case, then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Do you mind? It's time to end this. I keep. I keep not seeing what I'm clicking. I guess I ate the pasta. The taste is indescribable. <laughs> oh, I guess it tastes bad. God oh, dang it, no! I've killed you with friendship. I'm sorry, Papyrus, I've killed you with friendship. <laughs> I'm completely obsessed with Papyrus. <laughs> oh my gosh. Did he think that we have a crush on him? Yes, I should. I will hang out with Undyne. Yes, yeah, so we all be friends with Undyne. That was really interesting. Wait, nope, we're not done yet. Hey, we have his number. Platonically, yeah. <laughs> nice. Welp. That was interesting. Let's go back to the cave. <laughs> That was very, very interesting. We're super good friends. Through the ice. Crossed here. Through this cave. And save. Jeez, I've played a lot. And let's continue, because we're only eight minutes into this episode. That rock is falling. Oh, hey. This is a box. You can put an item in or take an item out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. All right, then. Well. Well, I mean, we have, we have no reason to take anything out of the box, so let's continue. What's the difference of these two places? Alright then. Hi there, Echo Flower. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Ooh, do I have to go into the water? Huh? There's a camera? What? There's a camera. Okay, where do I go from here, though, is the question. Oh wait, what's over here? What's... Oh, I have to go through. Ah, no! Oh, okay, I see what it is now. Alright, it took me a second. Yes, I made it. That is a weird effect. What? 
How did I prepare this? Oh, I'm hiding. Undyne. Oh gosh, Undyne looks freaky. Oh god, that was a mistake, that was a mistake, that was a mistake. I thought this was a wall, this is not a wall. Oh gosh, no, Undyne? Please don't kill me. No, okay, You're, are you letting me go? That is terrifying. Alright then. That- Hi there, monster kid. <laughs> how does how does they not re how do some of them realize that you're a human and some of them aren't? <laughs> okay, now there's music. Let's save. I'm feeling of dreading to have to say determined. That was freaky. Gosh, Undyne, Undyne, you scare me. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will sprout. Well, this seems simple enough. I like these puzzles, they're fun. But yeah, like I said, I know about all the characters and stuff. So, I know about Undyne, but I didn't realize that's when you see Undyne first, and that she is terrifying if you don't know anything about her. Actually, knowing stuff about her, she is still terrifying. And now I battle someone. All right then. I'm just gonna air. All right then. Oh my gosh! The winky smiley face. No! 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 Don't hit me with your sweat. All right then. I want to know what that says. When four bridge seeds align in the water, they will. What does it say? If an error is made, the bell blossom can call bridge seeds back to where they started. Oh, okay. Yes, more puzzles. Okay. So I have to get four of these in a row. I can do four, like, up like this, can't I? Yeah, that, that'll work. And then it'll be a bridge across. I keep saying across. It's across, not across. Yes, there we go. This'll work. Come on. Aha! Yes, I did it. Yay! Ring. Oh! Hi there, Pyrus! Or did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sufficiently until I got yours. Nice. What are you wearing? I'm asking for a friend. She thought she saw you wearing a bandana. Is that true? Are you wearing a bandana? What would you say? I am... I am wearing a bandana. I'm not gonna lie. I'm far too honest. So what am I wearing? Just to be sick. Uh... Yes, I'm wearing a bandana. And Toriel is still... Toriel is still dead. I feel so bad about that! Is there no way I could have saved her? 
A long time ago, monsters would whisper their wishes to the stars in the sky. If you hoped with all your heart, your wish would come true. Now all we have are those sparkling stones on the ceiling. Huh. Wishing room. Aww. Thousands of people wishing together can't be wrong. The king will prove that. I have mixed feelings about the king. Come on, sis. Make a wish. Ah! Ah, I keep forgetting how to press Z. Jeez. Dang it. Is it vaulted out its own wounds? I'm sorry, I'm just gonna have to keep killing you. Jeez, this music is so pretty. Just a third eye will see the real star someday. So I guess these are wishes people make while they look up to while they look at the telescope. Ah. Check wall. Huh? Wow, that's interesting. I will go there in a second. What do you say? Ah, seems my horoscope is the same as last week's. Hmm. Through here? What do you say? Ancient writing covers the walls. You can just make out the words. The War of Humans and Monsters. Ooh, this would be fun to read. Wait, what's down here first? Nothing. Okay, then. Continuing. Why did the humans attack? Indeed, it seems that they had nothing to fear. Humans are unbelievably strong. It would take the soul of nearly every monster, just equal the power of a single human soul. But the humans have one weakness. Ironically, it is the strength of their soul. Its power allows it to persist outside the human body even after death. Huh. If a monster defeats a human, they can take its soul. A monster with a human soul. A horrible beast with unfathomable power. It's an illustration of a strange creature. There's something very unsettling about this drawing. Is that a drawing of Asgore? And again with the odd dark- Oh god, we're gonna see Undyne again, aren't we? I'm right! Undyne Plez? Oh gosh, no, 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 no! Undyne, 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 no. Wait, they're hitting me, but they're not actually hitting me. Oh god, yes they are. Oh god, no. Holy crap. I was not aware that you... Me undying this early on, and that... This is such a hard battle. Come on, come on, come on. No. Just hide, 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 hide. Oh gosh, no, 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 no. I'm not here. Oh, hi, monster kid. <laughs> Just puts the kid back. Can I move again? All right. Am I, am I good? That was terrifying. Undyne is terrifying. Hi there, monster kid. Yo, did you see that? Undyne just touched me. <laughs> Are you unlucky? If you were standing just a little bit to the left. Oh gosh, that was- oh god, I'm terrified. Undyne is scary. Alright, that means a little, a little bit timeless the episode. Squeak. Oh, that's what the mouse says. This cheese has been here so long, a magical crystal has grown around it. It's stuck to the table. You poor mouse, you will never get cheese. Alright, let's save. Uh, extract the cheese from the mystical crystal. It fills you with determination. Alright, um... We're probably gonna end this episode here a little bit early, but yeah, we'll end it here. All right, I will see you guys next time. Bye.